Good morning, Honors Algebra 1. It is Wednesday, April 8th, and it is test day. So I wanted to give you a quick little tutorial on how to take the test today. I have already selected the Chapter 10 test um, from the class calendar, and let's go ahead and see what it says. The test consists of three documents, Part 1, Part 2, and Part 3. You're going to open the PDFs and use them to take the multiple choice tests in LMS. Each question is worth five points. LMS will automatically grade your test, so be careful before you make your final submission. You can use your book, any previous quizzes, and any notes you've taken from the instructional videos. Tests must be completed by 9 p.m. this evening. Alrighty, so here are our three documents, part one, part two, and part three. Let's go ahead and open up part one and just take a look at that. So you'll see here, part one has questions one through 13. So what you'll do is you'll use this document to go over to the first question and it'll just say problem one and then you will look at problem one on your PDF and you will choose one of the four answers and you will make your selection over here. Let's, I won't make a selection, but you will make a selection and then you'll go through to all 20 problems. Uh, here, I've already had this pulled up. This is part three and it's only got two questions on it, 19 and 20. I do want to pull up part two because I've got to just show you a little <laughs> detail there on part two. On part two right here, this is a negative 3x up here on the top of page two. This is a negative 3x. It's a little squished right there, but it is a negative 3x. Oh, and I want to say one more thing about the first one, and that is, come on, Let's go ahead and open that one more time. On page two, the shading isn't great when I made a um, PDF copy of it. This is the shading on number 11 to the right, and on number 12, the shading is this half plane down here in the lower left. So that's all I need to say about that. So it is due at 9 p.m. this evening and it will automatically grade your test for you, but you'll be allowed to go back and see which problems you missed and what the correct answer is. So I hope it goes well for you, and um, I hope you have a great day. I'll see you tomorrow.